I want to share with you how to reprogram your subconscious mind. Your subconscious mind is who you truly are, even if your conscious mind says something differently. And so I want to walk you through the four-step process to reprogram your subconscious mind. As scripture says, you cannot pour new wine into old wineskins or else they will burst. You cannot pour an old you into a new you and get the results that you desire. And so we have to reprogram the subconscious mind. Be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. So the first step is to recognize that you've been programmed. You've been programmed around money. You've been programmed around food. You've been programmed around success. You've been programmed around God and religion. You've been programmed. And most people don't accept that. Most people never challenge the old beliefs that they've had or were programmed with. They were programmed program when they were a child and they're running with those beliefs as if they came up with them. So that's the first thing is recognizing that I've been programmed. Once I recognize that I've been programmed, step two is to deprogram, literally to clear out my mind, clear out my beliefs around money, food, religion, etc. Clear it out and just have a blank slate. They call that tabula rasa, a blank slate. From there, then I, as the conscious mind, program the subconscious mind and put in a new program. I put in a new software and I test out that belief system around money, around food, around God. And then from there, I run the program and see if I get better results than I was getting with the old program. That is the process. And it is a continual process. When you get those results, if you're still not getting the results that you desire, guess what you have to do? You got to deprogram, reprogram and run the program again. And this is how we evolve. This is how we create better results in our lives, but recognizing that it's just not at the conscious level. It is at the subconscious level. We have to change our identity. You do not get what you want in life. You get who you are. And so you have to change who you are in order to get what you want. We are in the information age right now. And a lot of people think if I get more information, it will change my reality. You don't need just more information. You need to change your identity. Your identity is what actually shapes your experience, how you see yourself, and how aligned that is with how God sees you. So in order to reprogram the subconscious mind, recognize that you're programmed, then deprogram, then reprogram, then run the program, and continue to do that until you get the results that you desire in your life.